Hey guys, Adam Nicholas here again with Bowers Get Fit Friday. Today we're gonna work on how to create time and space with Patrick Kane. All right, so let's take a look here at how Patrick Kane creates space to beat his defender. He does three things phenomenally well. Creates a trap door, he weight shifts, and he has a tight cutback. All right, so let's take a look here and see how Patrick Kane creates his trap door. You notice how he created the space to his backhand side. After he creates that space, he's gonna shift his weight onto his right foot. He's threatening his defender that he's gonna come across the top of the circle into the slot area. So the defender has to respect that. Bring it back. Now let's watch the technique of his cutback and hit it here. Watch how he lifted his skate off the ice. Now that's very important on his cutback because he's gonna hit that outside edge, what I call a Z turn. What happens is when you make your turn, you're gonna glide on the outside edge. Well, Patrick Kane puts pressure, which allows him to hit that zero degree radius turn on his inside leg. Now he's gonna get tighter than he normally would with a regular power turn and he's gonna be able to accelerate so therefore his defender won't have a chance to respond to his cutback. Then he's gonna pull the puck back into his body to change the angle on the shot to get a quality scoring opportunity for his team. All right guys, keep working on creating space with those three key elements. Trap door, weight shift, cutback. For all you D out there, we'll see you back here next week to work on lateral movement with Aaron Ekblad.